Well, the, the thing that comes to my mind is the periphery, the word periphery. I'd like to actually see things from a different perspective because it is the Western world that is the, the periphery. Uh, it is Italy that is at the periphery, uh, uh, at the suburbs, uh, and the Middle East instead uh, is at the center. It is there that the future is built. This is a prejudice that perhaps us Westerners have had in the past, that we have considered uh, the others as different from, other, from us. So the Orient is from where we come, the, the East. So very often we thought that the East was exotic and that their things went very different from how they went in our culture and we forgot about our own past. For example, we forgot about something that took place in the Khomeini revolution. The Khomeini revolution took place with the divulging of tapes, of recorded tapes. And in fact, in that case, a technology was applied to promote a political revolution in a very effective way, with a result that we are still faced with at the present time. Now, very often people do not consider a detail that uh, uh, we should consider. This is perhaps a provocation. Now, uh, if we consider the immigrants in Italy, you will be amazed to learn that the amount of competences and knowledge of these immigrants is much, much higher of uh, the uh, uh, of the white collars in Italy. They often speak uh, many languages. Uh, they are very well aware of uh, uh, what happens in uh, politics, both in their own country and abroad. If uh, we were to create in Al Jazeera uh, a journal, a written uh, newspaper with Al Jazeera, probably it would have very, it would go very well. Why is this? Because there is a great vitality, because there is a great need for all of these things in that part of the world, much more than in Italy. Now, uh, of course, uh, I have a continuous contacts uh, with the Middle East, with the East, with Iran, and for me, Internet indeed is the best uh, tool to get in touch with the, uh, um, uh, all of these people. So one day I received uh, 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 an email in which somebody was talking about the Iranian Facebook and I was quite amazed about this concept. An Iranian Facebook? What was that? I wasn't uh, aware that actually there was a Facebook in Iran. And as a matter of fact, I learned that uh, it did exist. So uh, we have to try to uh, um, actually the uh, protagonists in all of this and furthermore we have to consider also that the relationship uh, of all of these means is not a relationship that is domestic but which is collective so I'm sorry to use an old category but mm, we are a society and however we are not a community as it happens elsewhere we are very often individuals who are not able to participate one with the other to create an atmosphere to live together and this is of course uh, uh, possible if we exploit our technical tools. So the periphery, once again we get back to this topic about the suburbs. Now perhaps the image is a bit masochist, but I believe that as Westerners we are presumptuous. And however, this presumption very often crumbles in the face of the future as it is uh, uh, created. So, one last remark, two examples. Now, uh, back in the times when Kraxi, the Prime Minister, was alive, I was in uh, Tunisia and I uh, saw a, a, a TV show on Kant and Wittgenstein, the two famous philosophers in French. And I was amazed to see such a very cultural, 
uh, uh, program on the TV, which was unimaginable f in Italy. And then I was given images, pictures of the book fair that took place in Tehran. Now, I'm, uh, uh, I love uh, uh, books, and for me, uh, the uh, book fair of Turin is uh, one of the major uh, book fairs uh, in uh, Europe. And I was amazed to actually learn that there were book fairs also in that country. Now, I, nine million people actually buy books in Tehran. I was amazed by the number of readers. And I also discovered that the dissertation of Karl Marx on Democritus was one of the books that was the best sellers. And I was amazed by this. This means that those people were very open to culture, much more than us. Then, of course, there are contradictions. Then, of course, there are difficulties, true enough. However, the competences and the knowledges of the East and the Middle East are by far greater than the ones that we have, who, are very, who sometimes call for a freedom of press because we feel that there isn't enough. 